Um, I've always loved helping people and I feel like education is one of the best ways to help them in like a variety of different ways, whether it be in school or outside of school, personal lives, academic lives. The reason I want to be a teacher is because I got inspiration from my two history teachers, Mr. Mahoney and Mr. Barrero. They really inspired me and during a time where I wasn't the best student particularly. I just felt like they really wanted to see me succeed, not just in their class, but as a person as well. They just really inspired me to become a teacher and I hope to inspire maybe other students to become teachers as well. I want to be a teacher because ever since I was little, like that's always been a thing that I had in mind. I want to teach music especially because I think it's a really great connector and it's something that students can carry along with them all throughout their life. I really like helping people. Um, I love kids and it inspires me to help them with whatever I can. Um, especially here in this area, I know it's a multicultural and I would really love to help those who need a little more help. I want to be a teacher because my grandpa was a teacher, so I feel like it's kind of in the family and just to, you know, teach the next generation, I feel like it'd be pretty rewarding. I've been surrounded by teachers my whole life and there's just been some really great ones that have influenced me and influenced my life and I want to influence other kids' lives the way that my teachers have in my life. Someday I want to be an athletic director. And it's like, yeah. <laughs> so I want to start off like teaching just to be in a school environment and then someday be like a high school athletic director and then some like hopefully I can get to like a collegiate level. Uh, growing up, I always went to these summer camps. I actually just started working there four years ago and going back, this will be my fifth year working there. And it was just building those relationships with those kids and like teaching them the knowledge you already know and help pass on that knowledge. And it's just so much fun to work with kids from any age group. Teaching, especially in this district, I don't know if you know, it's like around 7% of the teachers are like non-white. And that like really, really inspired me, especially for, I'm, I'm doing ESL. I don't know, I feel like I can really understand what they're going through. And yeah, that's what really inspired me to go. Like. Uh, Mr. Mahoney inspired me. He started the inspiration and then Mr. Um, Nunez, he really uh, inspired me a lot too because you know he just brings that energy. He's just fun to be around and I kind of want to be that teacher. A lot of people, but I think um, one of the most that stands out is Mr. Mahoney. Um, I love his passion for teaching and his passion for the kids. Um, I'd have to say Eric Parrish from Minnesota West and also Ms. Johnson. Mr. Mahoney, Ms. Benz, Ms. Bonsetter. I really like the way that they care about their students, but like in a fun way. Heather Kinnigy is my art teacher and I have to say she is by far one of my favorite teachers. She's just inclusive and very kind and compassionate towards others and a lot of fun to be in a classroom with. So like Gino. Uh, Mr. Sarbride, uh, Mr. Mahoney too, and Ms. Napton. There's like a lot of teachers that like, I really like. It's just, I never had a bad experience with like any teachers here. One of my friends passed away last year. Her name was William Merida, one of my best friends. Um, for me, it was always him, wanted, he wanted to be a teacher. He would always tell me about, okay, I'm going to school here, I can't wait to be a teacher. And so I was thinking to myself, you know, that's maybe that's something I might enjoy too as well. I would say Mrs. Van Note. She was like very, very important for me. She was my intermediate ESL teacher. And yeah, she was she was just the best, really cool. And she was just so nice to me. And I just wanna be that teacher to someone else, you know, you know, like you always need someone else except for your parents or your parent figure to like, you know, have a shoulder. I am going to the University of Minnesota in Morris. I'm deciding to go to SMSU. I'm gonna go to UND. Minnesota West or SMSU. I'm going to South Dakota State University. Go Jacks. SMSU or Minnesota West? I'm going to University of Sioux Falls for art education. Uh, I'm going to SMSU to play football and run track and pursue secondary education and administration. So as of right now, I'm starting at Minnesota West for about, I'm gonna say six months after I graduate just to get my two-year degree out of the way. This fall, I'm going to Minnesota West in Worthington for this year and next year, and then I'm going to SMSU in Marshall, so yeah. 